back from Bricks Cascade, which was really, 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 really fun. I recommend you guys going. I had a lot more fun. Uh, had a great time with a lot of good people. Um, yeah, so anyway, let's get this started. So I'm going to start with the the uh, swag bag is what they called it. I'm just going to dump this out here. Okay, there we go. So first thing you get is this Brick Arms Mock-On, which is supposed to be like a rock-on, but mock because it's Legos, and it's a guitar. So you get a Brick Arms guitar in a Brick Arms case. So there's that. You get this advertisement for Brick Shirts. Uh, oh, this is really cool, actually, because I do sports. So uh, Adidas Employee Store. Boom, 50% off. Really cool. Uh, then, oh, this is really cool. You get Bricks Cascade minifig. Which I think is cool, because they didn't have something like that at uh, BrickCon. So yeah, there's, there's that. Then I got this tile, which is the original Brick Engraver. So... There's that, and then I got this. I don't even know what this is. Um, <clears throat> I can pick it off on the ground. Okay, and this is like a mustache thing. And it's an advertisement for another store, I think. Hold on, I'm going to get my thing. And this was like the lanyard you had to wear. But yeah, the lanyard basically is like Brooks Cascade and stuff. Which is really cool, and it's really comfortable. So that was awesome. Um, let's see. Uh, I think that's it. Oh, and then also in the back, that's a guitar. So that's kind of cool. Alright, anyway. Let's, uh, start from... Oh, by the way, I didn't get any, uh, kits. So, if you're wondering... Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let me start with Brickmania and what I got there. So I got US Airborne decal... U.S. Russian Infantry <laughs> decal and U.S. Infantry, uh, and then um, let's see, yeah. So I got those, and then the Brick Mania was selling like these for four bucks each, like already, like no print on them. They had like gray and tan and stuff, so I got four gray ones, so I can have a collection of five for my Stalingrad troops. So there's there's that. Then I bought a Airborne, Brickmania Airborne, which I think is really cool. It's really well made, well designed actually. Let me show you. Uh, sorry, this is a little bit late um, of the video, but I've been really busy with tracks. So uh, there we go. Boom, perfect. Uh, it's a really good minifig. I love it. So. Um, next, well, I have these three heads here, so, um, I bought these three heads, and the bottom one's for Japanese, the middle one's probably for a British, uh, focus, focus, there we go, top one, okay, top one is actually kind of rare, and it's perfect for American minifig, it's in perfect condition, it's a really good find, so, I'm really happy I got that, um, next I got... Uh, these three minifigures for 10 bucks, and they're just all like random stuff, so I got a Baron Von Baron thing, or, I'm not sure if it's Baron Von Baron, but it's from the, uh, Johnny Thunder series, the Johnny Thunder torso itself, and these, oh my gosh, so I got this at Bricks and Minifigs, had pocket legs, <laughs> so I got that, and then I got another Johnny Thunder torso, because might as well go three for ten, right, and then I got this for the torso, and the head. I like the front head. It's really cool. And I don't like the back. I'm going to brass with this off. Um, and then I got another Paramount Baron. Or whatever. Um, and then <laughs> I bought a, um, a Lego minifig series um, Centurion. Because I think they're really cool. And I've always wanted one. So got that for like four bucks. Alright, so uh, let's... I got a lot of brick arms. I'm not gonna lie. This is a huge, I mean, like, huge brick arms haul. So, I'm gonna start out with. 
Okay, I don't know. I'm okay. I'll move this aside for right now. Um, let's start. A, let's start with uh, the stuff I bought. Uh, so the stuff I bought uh, were really just supplies I really, really needed. So I got a bunch of Stahlhelm and Yushankas uh, for my mocks, and then I got. I don't know, I got this for free. Um, and I got uh, four Brick Arms vests that came out. Uh, they were actually really cool. I'm going to put them on my figs and stuff. You can't really see it, but... I can't really see it. I'll see if I turn on the light, if that helps. <clears throat> I don't know if this is going to really help. Holy moly, that is bright. <laughs> okay. Alright, yeah, it helps a little bit. So that's one of the designs. They actually have four designs on these. So I got one of, or I got all four of the black ones. It's like Rifleman, Infantry, LMG, stuff like that. So they're all in designs. They're all, and it's Brick Arms, by the way. Then I got new... <laughs> Uh, vectors with a long barrel or suppressor. I mean, I heard it both ways. Um, extended barrel or suppressor with uh, uh, reflex or no hollow. It's actually a hollow sight. So that was cool. Actually, I'm gonna turn this off now. All right, there we go. Get back to normal state. <laughs> so I got two of those just because um, I got. Oh, I got one black helmet, or Modern Warfare helmet. Then I just got a bunch of Yushankas and all that stuff, and Snow Helms and such. That's just the stuff I kind of bought, like normal stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys are ready for this? I went beast mode on Overmold this weekend. I mean, I mean beast mode. <laughs> okay, so I got, I got one uh, Overmolded. Um, basically most into gone. And by the way, I think I'm going to start a collection now. Uh, one AK over molded, which, I mean, I bet you all have seen pictures of these, but, uh, they're really cool. So, oh, okay. Um, so basically it started out with, I lost two over molds at Burkhan. I lost a Thompson, which I bought again, and I lost a gun metal, um, 1911. And then, oh my gosh. This reminded me of Duke Nukem, and there's only like four of these, so I bought two. Gold, gold over mold, and I got two. Same grip and everything, so I think they're really cool. I, I like them a lot. Um, I got this, 1911, because it looks like a cop. Like, I can use this as like a modern day-ish cop. It, it can't really see, but it's a gunmetal barrel with a black grip, so I thought that was cool. And then I got this one, uh, pearl grip, or white grip, with a gunmetal barrel, so, that was cool. I'm actually running out of room now. Uh, um, oh, and I bought this minifig, because I'm going to try to start making more Japanese minifigs for the Brickinawa. So I got this, with the Type 42, no, Type, that's not Type 42, I think mean Type 96. Uh, Overmold, which is really cool, so it's in here, and I got the Nabu pistol, so that's cool. Um, also, I really wanted this torso, ever, I've, like, I've always wanted it, brick arms torso, you can't really see, there you go, and it's like an MG42 gunner, or 34, and there's one of these, only one, and I bought it, first thing I bought, bought a medic helmet, and I bought a new, what is it called, XBR4 wireframe. It's, an, it's like America. I had to get it. I had to. So I got that. And then, um, let's see. Oh, I got two of the crates. It's a 50 cal crate, but it's like clear. I got two of those for free. That's cool. 
Uh, um, alright, I got, okay, this is really cool, um, this is a STG gunner from World War Brick, at Brick Arms, I've always wanted these, and I only traded a couple short shot for it, so, it looks really cool, actually, I like that, that's like one of my favorite things I got, and then I'm gonna get, oh, I got stuff from Peyton, from his store, I got the new, new troll heads, and a couple of these pack things, for like my tank so got that now I'm gonna start with uh, probably gifts from Will Chapman this is gonna be a long video so bear with me so I got I'll turn this on for you I don't know if it'll help but I'll go this way I got a M1 carbine over mold gunmetal and brown. I got another one. The same color and everything. I got a uh, sprue of 19 uh, or Springfield Overmolds. Uh, where is it? There we go. I got one. Okay, so I'm not really sure what this is because the grip really makes it look different I'm just gonna call it a python because why not go from black <laughs> going to black off style so I got that with a uh, brown grip black barrel it's actually really cool and I got another one but with a uh... crap I dropped it um let's see if I can move my stand for a little bit there we go I found it okay Sorry about that. Alright, zoom in. Alright, there we go. So I got a, uh... You can't really see it well, but that's gunmetal and brown. Sorry, you can't really see it well. I'm doing this really late because this is the only time I can do it. And he gave... Okay, I don't know what this is called, but I've seen it. He gave me this. I work, I helped him do a couple stuff. Whoops. Shoot. There we go. He could probably, You guys probably recognized it. But it has like the three barrel thing. I don't know what it's called. So that's that. Um, I'm actually probably going to move my stand here. Make it better or easier. I don't know if I need this. Probably do. So I'm going to have that there. Um, so that's the gifts from Will. <clears throat> and then... Uh, let's see, where do I go from here? Oh, he gave, so Will Chapman, uh, he gave a, all, his whole box of short shotted, and to S.C. Edmondson on Flickr, and basically me and two other people on Flickr, uh, sorted for three hours. If you saw that picture, it was really cool. Um, so this is all the short started items I got. I got, I'll, I'll just pronounce the cool ones really. I got an bar version one, Panzer Foss, I think, version one. I also got, where is it? Um, got nunchucks. I got rail guns. I got a gold. 50 cal. I got a time bomb without a bomb, which is kind of weird. I got a buzz gun, and I also got a version one mini gun. And yeah, that's some of the cool things I got. Oh, gold. Got gold nunchucks, which are really cool. Uh, so that's all the gifts from Will, or from the short shot box that we did. And then from the good short shot stuff I got, like the overmold stuff, I get these out. I got another um, M1 carbine, but on the sprue. I also got, oh, this is cool. I got a brown, brown overmold M16 gunmetal. Really cool. I might trade this, I'm not sure. Okay, so then. Um, okay, so, 
I got two short shot Thompsons. Uh, actually, I don't know where the other one is right now. I might have put it in a wrong bag, but got two short shot Thompsons just by the end of the barrel. Then I got a normal Thompson, which is cool. Uh, then I got a M16. I'm gonna cut these off, by the way. Uh, over mold black and uh got metal but i think the the handle is just a little bit off but i don't really care then i got pearl grip the python which is really cool so i got that uh that's just the stuff we found um okay so then um clone true rex 39 was like oh hey i have a bunch of stuff so i can sell it to you for a pretty good price so i got I got a uh, version 1, I think. Uh, Thumper. Really cool. I got like a... I don't know what this is. I got that. I got a Gunmetal DP28. Doesn't look Gunmetal right now, but it is. There we go. And I got a Bren Overmold. Black and Gunmetal Mag. Then I got this for like a... 11 bucks or so, so that was cool. And then, he gave me this for free. Uh, me, me, and him, I don't know, <laughs> we always just mess around at conventions. He's a really cool guy. Um, he gave me a bar 42 for free, because I, I got all that stuff from him, and I was really happy, so. He gave me a bar 42, which basically, if you don't know what that is, it's an MG42 barrel with a bar stock and mag and stuff so that's really cool really really cool so thank you clone true bricks 39 so much Had a lot of fun <laughs> um okay let's see uh i'll start with uh oh so i got my contributors pack don't worry guys i'm almost done contribs pack okay so i got this contributors pack for being a part of Rickarosa. I'm going to start out with this. That's the case we, or brick arms crate we get. I really like this a lot. Uh, we get a uh, TT33, I think. Makarov, if I'm correct. Um, let's see. An SVT, no, whoops, wrong side. SVT. I don't know what's on my hand. Okay. Okay, this is really cool. So, um, Will A. Strawn on Flickr. Who is our battle coordinator? He gave me this because me and him are really buddies, basically. And he basically um, he accepted me into Picarosa, which was cool. So he gave me black overmold carbines, which is really cool. Uh, you get a Springfield, normal Springfield overmold, uh, a most in the gaunt overmold white. I like this a lot. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying not to get this separated, sorry. Okay, and then you get carbine gun metal. And then uh SCG forty four gun metal and a white carbine. That was really cool. So that was the contributors pack we got. And also we got uh this World War II pack, which basically I already opened it. it contained all this good stuff and it kind of came with this Brick Arms prototype, and our whole team got black overmold DP28s, which is really cool. So, uh, <clears throat> thanks for everyone, basically, for that. And then Brick Mania sponsored our thing, so he gave us a white. Okay, so basically, it's the white trooper like normal, but then he put that same design on a gray one, which is really cool. So, thank you, Dan, for that. That was cool. And, uh, yeah, um, thank you guys for watching this video, I know, <laughs> I know it's been a very, very long one, uh, oh, also, I forgot, <clears throat> um, uh, where is it, where is it, oh, yeah, okay, so I got these two shirts, um, I got a Panther shirt, basically from Brick Mania, then I got this Brick Rosa shirt, which is really cool, so, Thank you, Dan, for that, too. It was custom made. Um, oh, and then for my prizes I won, I got a billion of these pieces. 
I'm not kidding, hundreds. Then I got a bunch of these plate things. So yeah, that's what I got. So thank you guys for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe. And I also got two things on my badge. I got the brick cascade and the Isla brick arms for free. So that's cool. And a magnet. So that's awesome. Whew. Wrapping this up now. So thank you guys for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.